And now, here's Lars Fest, doing his first ever stand-up comedy on the internet. Hey, 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 oh, what's going on, everybody? Oh, man, so, anyway, there's these two flies, right? Like little bugs. One fly is pointing at the other fly's groin area, and he says, Your human is undone. It's time for run number 78. Welcome back, guys. How's everybody doing? Here we go. Could be literally anything. It's a completely random video game. 78 coming at you like a hot plate of eggs. Eden hot modes. Let's do it. Let's get into it. Oh my god. 17 tier 8. Okay. But geez. <laughs> Flight spectral. Wow. Jump book. One Piece book, uh, Bookworm. Alright, so we have uh, pretty good speed. Tier rate is garbage, that's okay. 3.3 .3 damage. Also, like I said, doesn't really matter because if you have Flight and Spectral, that's very, very strong. Uh, DFYS CG60 is the uh, seed, and let's go. And we're Princess Leia. Very cool. That is an awesome look. Alright, well, we can still use this for, like, mobility. Think of it as, like, a shield charge from Path of Exile. Alright, let's go. Alright. <clears throat> By the way, that's not my joke. Um, I actually read that in a Far Side comic uh, when I was a kid. So, that's not my joke. Just so you know. But you know what? I have a feeling you guys knew that. You guys knew that, right? Um, here's a little fun fact. I didn't know what that joke meant for a very long time, so. But now I get it. Like, now. Now I get it. But, like, I didn't get it then. Alright, well, hopefully this isn't too sloggy, my doggies. Should probably be killing this first. I guess it doesn't matter. Like, if you can just hide in the row, baby. If you can just hide in the rocks, I mean... It's very, it's insanely strong. Uh, you got a bomb in there? Hell yeah, yeah, da, da. Hell yeah, yeah, da, da. Am I muted right now? God, I hope not. I hope you can hear what I'm saying. Okay, good. Alright, well, since we only have one bomb, we're actually gonna uh, keep this for a second. Another bomb? Oh, I wish. No worries. All right, well, we could still keep putting out all these delicious fires and see if we can get some good stuff. Okay. More fires. Uh, we don't have a key, so we can't get into the shop arena yet. And boy, do I mean yet. Okay, that brings us to 11 coins. Very sleepy, very sleepy damage. Very sleepy hollow damage. Oh, that's right. You can shoot through the fatties. I forgot. So if you just stand still, what do they do? They just kind of pin you against the wall. That's it. What if I go on the other side? Just pin you against the wall. That's it. Interesting. I was just curious. Okay. Dude, do, do you guys remember when uh, those stone fatties didn't ever get tired? <laughs> like when they first came out? Oh my god, that was so annoying. Uh, because now they get tired, but boy, did they, they didn't used to. So Okay, every tier hits, hopefully. And one tier's up, and we're freaking good to go. Don't say stuff like that. Then it's, it's never going to happen. Don't say stuff like that. Okay, this goes here. Alright. And there's our key. Uh, we could go check the sh Oh, wait, the shop is free anyway. Well, let's check it with our bomb first, then. Before we commit... Because our health is pretty good right now. It's fine for now. 
Um, we also don't really need this book either because we already have flight, so. Uh, that doesn't look like that's gonna pay out though, so I'll take. I'll take just that and we'll blow up this. <clears throat> So whenever you're going into the second floor of a of like a you know basement two caves two whatever depths two, um, it's always good to hold on to five cents, so it gives you like a chance to uh, spawn an arcade on the on the second floor. Uh, whatever, I don't want this. Uh, mainly if you have actually you know what I actually will use this. Because if we do get a arcade, we can ma maybe make some plays with this. Like I said, it's not like we need Jump Book. Jump Book's nice for the dodge, but I don't think we really need it. I just want to see if we get some value out of this item. It's possible. Oh, Monstro. Dear Monstro, I know things have been difficult between us. But if you could just go ahead and give me a tears up, I promise you I will stop scraping all of the paint off of your fence in your front yard. I promise. I won't do that anymore. I also won't park so close to your car on the street also. So can you just give me one tears up? That'd be great. I mean, th think of the perks. Think of the perks you'll get. If you give me said said tears up. Oh my god, what a chunky boy. He is happy though. He is a happy boy. Let's go, homie. Please. Please. Love your boy. Signed, and I'll, I'll even put one of those wax seals on it with my family crest on it. Well, oh well, let's go. Come on, baby. Come on, arcade. Okay, burning basement. Okay, where's that arcade at? I hope we find it. Could be some fat values. I mean, we're already, like, good to go, I'd say, through... Honestly, just with Flight and Spectral alone... Well, I guess we could still get some weird bosses, but that's a big buff. It's like a big... It's, it's, a, it's a huge thing to have, is all I'm saying. Uh, we're not going to go straight in there, because that could be a, a mini-boss room. So, when you have, like, a low tier rate build like this, not build, but start, I should say, um, one thing that's always nice to think about is the mentality of every tier hits. Because, like, especially if it's, like, a dangerous room, um, and it's more so if you don't have flight. Because if you have flight, you could probably just dance a lot of the stuff, or just stand in rocks or over a pit. Um, but if you don't have flight... You're gonna, you're gonna want to put those enemies down quick. So. Okay. Come on. Okay, we can hold on to this pill for later. I'm sorry, YouTube. I know it's dark. Not for long. Okay. Oh, man. <laughs> Let's see. At least our damage isn't terribly awful bad. Like, 3.3 is pretty good. That's pretty normal. Normal starting damage. It's like the 2.7s that are, you know, 2.8s. Those are the real sad times. Our shot speed's pretty bad, too. Uh, do you have a cool trinket in here? Trinket, trinket, trinket. Jada Trinket Smith. Oh, wow. Never mind. Not complaining, not complaining. Okay. Alright, well. 
Nothing. Do the boxy dance. It's a glass box dance. Pretend you're in a glass box. Glass box dance. Walk in a box. You'll never get hit. It's a boxy dance. What if that was a real song? You know? Maybe it shouldn't be. Uh, let's find the shop, though. Oh, it's right here. Look at that. Okay, double bombs we're actually going to get. So, here's kind of a cool trick. Not really a trick, but double bombs. And then see how this bomb is single? You know, it's not dating currently. You can just do that. You can do the same thing with, uh, with Humbling Bundle as well. Just so you know. It's pretty... Pretty nice. I always forget to do it, but yeah. All right, we can go straight in here, and we'll probably get that later. We'll probably leave with that. Okay, justice card's nice. Let's just pretend that we know that this justice card is going to give us a troll bomb, or not. Well, here we'll blow it up. So yeah, you, you can kind of use those as like. Oh, it's, it's probably going to be a troll bomb. Like, plan for it to be a troll bomb kind of thing. That way you get more value out of it. Fat value meals. Boy, this yum heart's really coming in huge, huh? Know what I'm saying? Don't worry, it's, it hasn't had its time yet. Oh my god, would you just give me a tears up? Just one? That's all I ask. All I ask is one tears up. And some shot speed. Shot speed's pretty bad too. Okay. Oh wait, you know what? Just fire is your friend. There we go. Alright, so that brings us to 10 and... Wow, really? Alright. Oh, phase through the wall. You can't get me. Yeah, it's pretty game-breaking. I think you can still get hit by those projectiles from the pink guy, though. Or from, from these headless dudes, I think. Like, if they're close enough, maybe? Get you just right? I actually don't know. I'm kind of curious. Okay, well... Didn't get a frickin'... Oh, here, here we go. Here, g give me the quarter, too. Oh, I missed one of them. Well, that's four bombs for one. That's dope. Gotta do it. Gotta do it. Very nice. Alright, one luck is cool. Uh, also, we'll spend one more bomb instead of two keys on that other door. So that door is uh, two keys to use, or to get into. Okay. Um, man, I would go in there into that little that little closet area, and I think we will, but not right away. I'm also gonna take this, and let's just go kill the boss and see what we get from the Devil Delio. Hopefully, something nice, something so nice and oh so spice. Uh, super secret? Hell yeah, that... Oh, very nice trinket. So this trinket allows us to open gold chests for free. But not gold doors or any doors, for that matter. Just strictly gold chests, which is actually really nice. Oh man, the shot speed's gotta go. Yeah, you got that binky, Doug? You got that binky duck? Oh, come on, that hit. Every tier hits. Oh, not everyone. Oh, not everyone, not everyone, not everyone. <laughs> I have terrible aim, jeez. Hell yeah, sleep now in the fire. Hey, Hell yeah. Alright, we'll take that afterwards. Uh, that's a little bit of speed, though. We're gonna take that for sure. We'll take him and him. 
this and that, so, so we can get the speed from that, and then... Uh, we're gonna take all of our hearts first, and then we'll take that last. Only because we want that bone heart to be on the outside of our health, just in case we find a sack room or something like that. Uh, and because... Oh, we, we have a lot of health, actually. We, we can go check this out. Oh, that's right. We could have gone through the secret room. Hello? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Uh, isn't there one on sale? Yeah. Yeah. There is one on sale. And don't forget this either. Don't forget that. Uh, okay. Now let's go take this. Yeah, so if we would have done that the other way, then we would have had like two and a half, three and a half soul hearts. Um, on top of our bone heart, which is not as helpful. That tear rate is so nice, though. Where are we going? We're going through here. Cutting through. Alright. What do you got? Alright. Just in case it was a uh, grizzly graveyard or something. Okay, very nice. And give me the... Give me the quarter. No quarter. Uh, we're gonna blow this up once just in case we get a um, XL floor. Because I learned recently that if you have five cents before an XL floor, it's the same as saving five cents for a um, arcade on like Caves 2 or something like that. Which is such a weird mindset. I've never messed with that. I should have used that pill. I don't know why I didn't. Okay, Curse of Darkness. Uh, let's go in here first. Okay, we're not going to touch that yet. Not quite. Okay, much, hey, much better tier rate. I'm just going to heal this now just so we can start charging it up. Also, one cool thing about multi-dimensional baby is every time you walk into a room... You're on top of multi-dimensional baby. Which means you're you're gonna have that buff to your tears. Like right away. Which is really nice. So obviously that's only good if the enemy that you're killing is in the middle of the room, but you know, more often than not, that does seem to be the case. Well at least I got that. Okay. It's also really good if you have uh, Eye of Belial too, because then you can just get the buffed, buff tiers that then become Eye of Belial that then do even more damage kind of thing. Okay. Uh, let's keep looking around for the Shop Arena. Actually, don't touch these yet. Not quite. And what is this? Nasink. Free stuff. Uh, the bombs we can take. Let's just not touch those other things. Only because we could find humbling bundles still. Okay. Very glad our, our tier rate is much better now. And I keep forgetting that we have... Uh, um, Freaking spectral tiers. There you go. Yeah, so you can see the damage difference. It is... A lot better. Okay, what do you got? Oh, look at that. Yes, please. Yes, please. Okay, let's keep looking around. At least we have good tiers. And okay starting damage and flight and spectral. <laughs> Wait. Watch it, big boy. Okay, thank you, thank you. Uh, we're actually gonna use this bomb. Oh, would have been sick, though. Would have been sick, though. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna wait on that. Super Secret is definitely right there. 
Search your feelings, you know it to be true. <laughs> Hell yeah. Uh, can I, can I have some runes? You know, I was just thinking. The whole last run that we did on YouTube, I don't think I got a single rune. Like, honestly, like, not a single one. That's actually kind of bizarre. Um, normally you find something, like a Hagalaz or something. S-um-thing, uh, something, right? Okay, we'll leave that for later. Don't pick it up yet. Luck up this whole time? I didn't even see it. That's okay. Well, I didn't see that it was lucky anyway. Alright, now we can go... Uh, take more options. We can go check this out. Do, 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 Uh, sure. Only because we have flight and spectral. Um, so taking... Taking piercing, like, super early. By super early, I mean, like, any time, but, like, before caves, too. Uh, you gotta think about that, because, like, if, if you're relying on, on the pushback from your tiers to be able to, like, you know, control enemies and, like, survive, then, you know, you're, you're not gonna have that anymore. So, I think it's I think it's not really as important if you already have flight and stuff like that. This flight is just such a flight alone gives you such a different playstyle uh, than not having it. Obviously, it's just a lot safer. Like you could just hide in in rooms basically, hide from enemies. Uh, we're going to actually just destroy this bone heart now cuz there's nothing we can really do from it, right? There's nothing that we have that can benefit from that, so we're just gonna kill it off. So here, let's move this a little bit further forward. Uh, that might be a okay, a little bit more forward. Uh. That's probably close enough. One, two, three. There we go. Um, only because, like, we have a bunch of health on this floor and there's some in the shop. So, why bury a bone heart, you know? I don't know. If you're gonna bury a bone heart, you might as well bury, like, five of them. Uh, because they are valuable later and they're literally, like, double health later on, but, um... Ooh, wow, I didn't even see this. Okay, awesome. There's a hidden gold poop in there. I was wondering, because I didn't see the fly. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Uh, let's just kill this boss now. Okay. Yeah, so, I mean, we're obviously lacking put-down power, but we did get a tears up, so that's nice. So it's still a little bit sloggy, but not, like, bad, you know? Definitely not bad damage, just kind of kind of chill. Y you know, like, um, you know, like, the smell of, like, an antique store? Our damage smells like an antique store. You know, it's kind of musty. L little, little bit of a, um, little bit of a musty smell there, you know? Just, just a wee bit. Nice catch. Okay. Damage, damage, damage. Alright. We'll take it. And we are going to use this pill after we get health. Man. Gotta really give it up for this yum heart. Really coming in huge. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Uh, let's see. Sun card we'll probably keep. And donate one. A hey, small is great. And let's also just kill this guy and hope to get a steam sale. Okay, goodbye. I mean, the alternative would have been just, what, jump book? Which is like, who cares, I guess. 
you know what? We have ten keys. I'm just gonna take this. I think we'll get more out of this than uh, the other. Since we already have ten keys. If we had two keys, I would definitely take the other one. Let's go. But, I don't know. Rather get more money at this point. Here we go. Bloop. Okay. This is this is the floor where we get all of the Danos. Hopefully. Or right, this is gonna get weird. <laughs> it's already kinda slow, but what do you got in here? Okay. Uh sure, what do you got? Okay, we need to find we need to get to the shop first before we open any chests. Everything hinges on the shop. Okay. Hey, nice. Free health. Also, a nice thing is now is we've pretty much had like a dead active item the entire game, pretty much. I don't know, I, I guess Jump Book is not really dead. Ooh, that was close. Just seemed like, uh, you know, why not, why not just take the risk and get a, uh, hope to get a, you know, arcade. Get some extra money, get some extra possible health. This is some pretty tickly wickly damage, though. Don't open that yet. Okay, we're gonna blow this up. Ball and chain we don't need. I'd rather spend a key on this door than blow it open. Spread out the resources. Uh, what do you got? Here, chariot and oh, it doesn't matter. All right, what do you got? <laughs> uh, I'll take sticky babies, juicy sack. Why not? Okay, we can open all this stuff now. A chest inside a chest. Uh, boss room. Oh, okay. Well, I'll see you guys in nine years when this fight's over. I'm just kidding, we do have piercing, so that helps a little bit. It helps a little bit, dude. Um, I'd like to start this moment right now, talking about um, what I had for dinner the other night. My roommate and I... It's, a, it's very simple. This is not, like, groundbreaking stuff. But my roommate and I marinated tri-tip in olive oil and uh, balsamic vinegar or balsamic vinaigrette whatever for over 24 hours in the fridge and we would take turns like taking it out and like massaging it a little bit moving it around <clears throat> and it was some of the best tri-tip I've ever had in my life it was really really good um, so yeah that's I just wanted to tell you that that's it that's all that's all there is to that story. That's the end of that story. Uh, one, two. Then we can do this. What do you got? Synth oil? Synth oil? Homies? Oh homies. What are you doing? Well I gotta take these. I gotta take these. I need homies right now, dude. Come on. Or synth oil. That's not it, but we have enough we have enough speed to warrant doing that. Okay, the other one we can just take with us. Uh this is also catacombs. I don't know if I want to fight in there without a a teleport. But hey, we did get some damage. We got the pact, we got the Horror of Babylon. Is this the superintendent? Okay, we could blow up the uh, mushrooms if we wish. I can avoid being seen if I wish. But to disappear entirely, that is a rare gift. Sometimes I watch movies and I'm like, dude, that must have been so fun to work on. Or like shows. I just I just finished Letterkenny, like all the episodes, and I was like, dude, it must have been so much fun to play, to, to play these characters. Just to, like, be a part of something like that must have been so fun. So. Anyway. 
All right, this is much better damage. This is way better. Way better than what we were at. Okay. That's three to one on the mushrooms. Okay. Oh, that would have been sick, though. Uh, super Secret's probably over here. I gotta, I gotta do three to one. I'm a gambling man. I'm a gambling man, dude. Okay, uh... Let's see, seven bombs. Let's just try it here. Here. Okay. Is it right over here? It is right here, you sicko. Bamboozled. Bamboozed. Could be here. There we go. Alright, well. Uh, we'll buy all that other stuff after, and then we'll take pills. I don't know if we're going to do that boss challenge room, though. Uh, I'm hesitant to take this, but we, uh, we do have pack. That's a little bit of damage. I mean, we literally got that on this floor. But it's alright. We have more health now, and we have... Oh, no! <laughs> I don't want that. I don't want a health up. I want health down. Down, down, down. Health up. Did it say health up on it? I just figured it's orange. We didn't take this one yet. What, are you kidding me right now? <laughs> Come on. Oh, and I just took a heart. Oh, cool. Oh, cool. Oh, my goodness. Guys, don't forget to drink water. It's very important. Alright, dank depths. Yeah, so the reason why, like, boss challenge rooms in the caves, especially if you have, like, like, for the most part, flight and spectral doesn't even matter. The flight kind of does if it, if it has, like, creep. But the bosses that I'm afraid of in the, the specifically the caves variant of the boss challenge room, which would be the, the, the red ma, red mega ma, whatever that's called. Uh, the one that does all the crazy quick variations of, of tears, not the flame ones. Those dudes are very dangerous. And each one of their projectiles does like a whole heart of damage. And that one's always paired with the um, the big mega fatty, the one that does the... Oh, dang it, dude. The big mega fi fatty, the one that does the shockwaves. And the problem with him is sometimes the shockwaves you can just get unlucky. So you could... There's a chance that you just get kind of screwed out of some, you know, out of some health. Um, but also, he just has so much health that he just takes a while to kill, so it's, I don't know. All that for a couple chests, I don't know if that's worth it, personally. Okay. Well, since we got no shop, we gotta get rid of this health, man. This health's gotta go. Red health specifically, by the way. Wonder why they use this tile for this, uh, you know, where only only one wall is showing. That's weird. That's kind of strange, right? Uh, lemon party. All right, we'll use these after. Oh yeah, we could go straight in here. Hello. Ooh, yes, please. Ooh, baby. That's nice. Alright, so now... <laughs> the power. Palpentine? Palpentine? Unlimited power. Freaking Palpentine, man. Dude, if I could shoot lightning out of my hands... Like, I'm trying to think, like, what would I do with that? Because, like, I feel like that's just pretty much just destructive for the most part. I guess if someone was like, hmm, 
Well, it depends. If I could shoot out a little bit of lightning, like a little bit, like I could put my hand on someone and give them a little jolt, then I guess you could possibly have a job in the, you know, like, if, if you were going to save somebody's life. But that's if, if it doesn't hurt the person worse, right? And if it's effective. So instead of doing, like, the whole, you know, clear, you know, you could just be like, you could, like, show up on the scene and just, like, you know, take your hood off, take your cloak off, and be like, nobody touch him. You know, like, like that fish in Finding Nemo, you know? And it's like, you know what to do, because you have lightning hands, lightning fingers. If I could do that, though, I would probably want to be known as... I think lightning fingers would be fine. Because lightning hands doesn't sound good enough. Like, hey, oh, sh oh shit, see that guy? That's lightning hands. Or, oh my god, you see that guy over there? That's that's lightning fingers, dude. That guy's crazy. He could do lightning with his fingers. And then one other person's like, well, which one is it? Is it lightning hands or lightning fingers? And then the other person's like, I, I don't know. But there he is. He, he can do it. All right, let's just go. Okay. Because I feel like if you had lightning fingers and you weren't able to control it all the time, then I would have to have some sort of restrictive handwear that would, you know, ground... They would be hand grounders. They would, they would have to ground my hands. Hey, speed up's nice. You know, because I don't want to just go around, you know, hurt people. That's no... That, you can't do that. Imagine trying to, like, eat an ice cream cone and all of a sudden it's like... It just explodes in your hand. That'd be horrible. I want to enjoy my ice cream, dude. I want to enjoy my ice cream, dude. I don't want to, like... I don't want to, like, blow it up. Uh, where's that pill at? Isn't there a pill in here? Oh, it's... Look at... Look at it. Where's Waldo? Where's the pill? Where's Waldo? See on the map right here? It says that there's a pill in this room. Where's Waldo? Where is it? There it is. Isn't that bizarre? <laughs> and it was blue. Wow. Incognito pills. Interesting. Alright, let's go. Let's get out of here. Uh, I have never seen that uh, happen before. That's, that's wild. I'm glad we got to share this. You know, I'm glad that we get to share that moment right here. And anyone else who doesn't watch this video, they don't get to share that. So... But I'm glad we get to share that. You know, you and I. <laughs> you know. Or if there's multiple people watching the same video at the same time, you know, y'alls and I, y'alls and I get to, get to share that together. Uh, anyway, uh, let's, here, let's do the tricky. Huh. 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 Okay, let it play out. There we go, might as well get procced. Alright. Now that means we get to go in here. Let's actually look for the shop first, though. Because we might get Mom's mom's key. I've been a lot better about uh, waiting on that. Waiting for Mom's key potential. Which is a little paranoid, but it could happen. Oh, look at this double right here. Look at this Michael Caine double. It's a double. Uh, it's not a wet knock. Uh, okay. Let's go. I didn't mean to open that. I didn't mean to open that. It's okay. You gotta watch out for the chargers, man. They'll get you. Uh, okay. Tar guy, get out of here, man. Dude, look, look at the value. Between, between Jacob's Ladder, Piercing... Like, that's, like, mad value. And, like, I, I don't know, decent tier rate? That's insano values. Okay. Oh, it's even more when you go through here. I didn't know that that did that. 
Well, I guess that makes sense if it, if you can hit the wall. That makes sense. Okay, never mind. I, I, I know. I know. I was just making sure that you know. So. Okay. Alright, hold on. We are getting so many health drops. It's like, it's actually insane. Uh, what do you got here? Okay, don't take any of this money. That guarantees us a shot, by the way. That's why it's always nice to go into the, um... Go into the secret room first, because if there's a greed in there, then you know that your shop is good to go. Okay. Jeez, we are dropping all kinds of looties. Uh, and it's reroll. I'm taking double trinket space. And we can't kill the boss first to check, uh, because the boss doesn't drop it on Depths 2, so. And two bombs. Strength card. Roll it. We got plenty of health on the floor. Uh, yeah, I'll take charge babs. Better believe it. Candle. I mean, right now what we have isn't doing anything. Friends to the end. Emperor. Okay. Oh, <laughs> baby, baby. Here we go. Ready? We're going to go one, two, three. Strength. Strength. Four. I'm probably going to lose health. Uh, I've had I've had that do some weird stuff before. Whatever. Okay, so that's awesome. Now we have permanent horror. Uh, sure, our, our build is good enough. Yeah, let's do it. Okay, and a temperance. Unfortunately, we don't have any reroll machines. Uh, yeah, we could take this. Power card, who cares? Void. Uh, no. Oh. Cricket. Fat. Cricky. The crickiest of the icky. Very nice. Uh, let's see. That's book number two. Nah, that's okay. What else you got? Guppy, I'll take. Alright, let's just clear the rest of this floor before we do anything else. And we'll also clear with this. Yeah, this is getting... This is getting very strong. I can feel the power coursing through me. Okay. More money, very nice. Uh, Super Secretos. Super Secret does? Hell yeah, what do you got? Oh, fatty health. Akira health, very nice. I gotta watch that again. That movie never gets old. Uh, here we go, we have, we have chaos and double. <laughs> Mama Mega. Hold on a second. Because if that's Mama Mega, we might actually use. Okay, it's unfortunate. We could have got more money out of those hearts before we used them, but that's alright. Alright, let's do this now. Of course, some bombs. Okay. Ow. Away from my face. Okay. Um, let's see. Friends to the end is whatever. What else was in here? Oh, here's some extra stuff. Don't forget this. Or we can't come back because this is depths too. Uh, what else was in here? Give me the money. There we go. Okay. 
Uh, okay, so it's either... Well, we don't have any teleports, which is kind of annoying. Right? We have Emperor. That's a teleport, but not the right kind. Yeah, Emperor's not going to do it for me. Uh, okay, keep rolling. A shovel. Shovel. And one more use of the shovel. Just to see, because you can actually get um, crawl spaces with this and possibly black markets. Not sure what the chance is, but it, it's quicker than you think, actually. Um, quicker than one might think. How about that? What is what is this? Perks with no sack room. Damn it, dude. Uh, I guess we'll take... We'll probably just take Emperor and this. Emperor and Blue Candy, I guess. I guess. Let's go. Oh my god, I forgot to use it. Or forgot to pick it up and use it. I completely forgot. Well. That was a big mistake. Oh well. <laughs> that was a huge mistake. So what we could have done, but I screwed it up. Because I was trying to plan too much. Was we used Mama Mega. And Mama Mega only explodes the room that you use it in. And every other room that you haven't explored. So if you go into the boss room... It'll blow open the door of the um, boss challenge room, the boss rush, I'm sorry. And then you could go in there, take whatever item you want, and then Emperor card back to mom fight. But I forgot to do it, so. Oh well, let's go. Get out of here, man. <laughs> this is why we can't have nice things. You know, this is exactly why we can't have nice things. Wizard. Whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, okay, what is this? Ace of Diamonds. Alright, we'll hold on to this. Oh, man. We don't even, we honestly, we don't even need this candle. We didn't even need to take this. Death card. Okay. But the candle is also nice for bosses specifically, though. Okay. Especially, like, if you have a build like this, I mean, the, the regular enemies are just going to explode. This is very, very nice. Uh, real quick, I just want to see what's touching this 2x2 two two room. Whoa. Okay, weird. Very strange. Um, yeah, let's go in here. Oh, that's alright. That's worth a heart, why not? What I was looking for was like a downward facing... Um, like closet room. Because that could have, could have been like one of the double reroll rooms. You never know. Okay. He's stud. Oh my god, a room bag. And a little cutie. Uh, you can get in here, cutie. Uh, you know what? Also, we could take this too. Why not? Lost contact. Because we do have piercing. It's actually really good with piercing. Uh, we could feed him a couple hearts, I guess, real fast. Just real quick. Here, eat this heart right here. Kalima. And eat this too. Hey, fat heels. Very nice. Alright, let's get out of here. Nyom. Nyom. Curse of the blind, eh? That's fine. Speed up, very nice. 0 0.002 speed, very nice. Uh, drowsy kids. So we, we could just use the uh, the Emperor now, but 
I kind of like using it in like Cathedral. Cathedral's kind of a nice skip. I don't know why. I, I guess I guess Loom is fine too. Soul hearts, hell yeah. Whenever you see the, the blue Larry, you're gonna get a soul heart at the end. Very nice. Dude, these look like little bubble bob. Remember that game Bubble Bobble? Oh, a fat perky Jackson. Wow. Dude, these look like little bubble bobble tears. Oh! I didn't see him. Okay. Man, I used to rent Bubble Bobble. That was one of my most rented games. Was Bubble Bobble. Number one rented game of all time that I rented more than any other game was Mega Man 3 on NES. Um, our little, our video store had one copy. Oh, that's just great. Oh, oh my poor thumb. Um, so yeah. Mega Man 3 followed by, I'm trying to think. Maybe Bayou Bill? Is that, what it's, is, that, is that what it's called? Bayou Bill? I think it was Bayou Bill. I used to rent that game a lot. Um, what else did I rent? Oh, a fat Yaura. Um, I used to rent um, the game Hook on Sega Genesis. Yeah, that was a old game. Old timer game. You know, the experience of renting games gone dude it's 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 in the past dude. it's freaking gone uh real quick we're gonna try to find one more heart and then we're gonna yara said heart that'll work just a quick one and just a quick one just so we can have two birth rows <clears throat> let's see what other games that i rent a lot um there was this game on NES where, like, what you did was, like, you had to constantly climb upwards, but the way that you did it was you had to, like, shoot rainbows and then climb on the rainbow and then shoot another rainbow and then climb on the rainbow and then shoot another rainbow. It was, I don't remember what it was called, but it was, like, this weird little cutesy game. I don't know why I, I just played that when I was a kid, but yeah, anyway. Can't remember what that game was called. I have to look that one up. <clears throat> also, I remember being deathly afraid of the cover of uh, Blaster Master. Blaster Master scared me, because I thought that was like a real creature. So, anyway. This is a long time ago, though. This, this is like a year and a half ago, so like, you know, not anymore, but you know. Well, we got rid of our Emperor card, so good old good old Perthro is going to lead us to victory, hopefully. Unless we get a Curse of the Damn Blind. Actually, that's fine if we do. Ooh, look at that spread. Oh. Oh. Huh? Oh. Nice little spread shotgun. Okay, uh, yeah, let's go in here, too. Uh, that would have been Bookworm, but I was too cheap. Too cheap, didn't want to pay for it. Alge's room, okay. Whoa, 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 watch it, big boy. Nice heals, little one. I, okay, okay, nice. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, let's -a go. Look at all those blocks, dude. Fat blocks. Is he even shooting tears? No, the answer is he is not. He's not shooting tears. Not nice flame, by the way. Jeez. Way to way, way to really light him up. All right. Don't be blind, don't be blind, don't be blind. If it is, we'll find a Degas. It doesn't really matter, but don't be blind. Okay. 
All right, uh, next thing is we're gonna go for one more, one more rune. You know what, we're gonna go for two more runes before we open those. Because we could, we could get a Yara. We could Yara the chest and the Perthros, which is basically like Yaring multiple times, kind of. Not really, but kind of. Mm, not really the same thing, but you know what I mean. Hell yeah, get him, little meat man. Okay, a black rune. All right, so we got black rune and black rune and. Oh my god, look at those gifts! Wow, fat gifties. Jeez. I'm not gonna lie, the 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 dead eye with this is actually pretty awesome. Like, the charge shot alone is very cool. <laughs> it's like a straight-up cannon. Uh, okay, this should be our last... Uh, rune right here. Hopefully. Or not. Runes? Yaura? Oh, no. It's okay. All right, let's open it up. I ain't waiting. Absolutely not. Uh, <laughs> All right, where's that black rune at? Watch the stats, watch the stats. Okay, all right. A little, little bit of damage, a little bit of luck. A little bit of all the good things that makes this build tick. Love it. I'll just stand here and not move. Hell yeah. Wow, very nice. Alright, so that started off very strong simply because of the fact that we had Flight and Spectral. It's just, it's just very strong to start with that. I don't care if you have like 25 tier 8. That's just insanely strong to have that from the get-go. Because it just gives you crazy freedom. Uh, let's see, a little bit of speed here. Nice tiers. Damage, damage. That was huge. That was very much so needed. Uh, honestly, the, the piercing, too. Piercing with Spectral is nice. Um, Jacob's Ladder was the true carry. Even got, like, a Multiplier, too. It's not bad. I actually like that. That's a cool little build. Kind of. Could have been a lot better, but still cool. Uh, guys, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. <clears throat> that's run number 78 for you. Jeez, this thing's getting up there, man. It's getting up there, dude. So, uh, big cheers to you. Thank you guys for watching. And, uh, I hope that you have, uh, the strength. And I hope that you... I hope that you have a good dinner tonight. I hope that after said dinner, you know, maybe you have a good sleep. You know, good sleep is nice. I also hope... That when you watch whatever show you're watching, that the next episode just plays automatically and doesn't just play some random episode from Days of Our Lives, because that happens to me on Hulu. So I hope that that doesn't happen to you. Uh, so I'd like to cheers to that. I'd also like to cheers to uh, the show Cheers, because you know Cheers to Cheers because it's it's a good show. It's it's good. Bye.